Uh, hi, my name is Josefina, and this is the first time I'm going to participate at EVOS, and I'm an artist, uh, I will think of myself most uh, as a printmaker. Um, these are some relief prints that was what originally I did, um, printmaking, monoprinting. Later on, I did silk screening, which is I really like because of the graphic uh, quality of this media. And the subject matter usually is political. That's where my strongest uh, work comes out when I have a strong opinion. This is the collaboration with Margot Pepper, she's a poet, and we did a show called The Written Word, and we had to read the poem and then illustrate it, basically. And so I thought, because it's called Sending the Troops, and it's about a, a soldier that, um, that is like writing from home, I thought that it was suitable to uh, handwrite it and overlay it over this map of the world and and the intervention and, and presence of American uh, army. And then after that, I I got rid of the poem and I started playing with words that we use or we hear in the media, such as collateral damage, collision forces, friendly fire, shock and awe human shields, smart bombs, lateral damage, military casualties. So it's words that at the beginning we hear and then we just get used to them and basically we don't even have to imagine that anybody's getting hurt. So and then maybe they decide that those words are not correct anymore and they will come up with something else. So it's, it's a comment on, on that. And this is what I'm doing more now is with Colombia, where my heart is, and family. And this is Juan Valdez, which is the, somebody who was created as a campaign to, for Colombian coffee and in the 60s. And then, but he symbolizes many other things. And I'm using the same image. And then I continue developing the image. Maybe I get rid of the background. But um, again, it's the same. These are images of G.I. Joe toys that I took from a catalog from a Toys R Us. Because it all begins at a very early age to condition men to go to war and even though if we buy Legos our kids will make a sword or we'll make a weapon. 